previously on Skyrim. I miss. Hold on. Don't hit me. I missed again. My perfect aim. Warning. The following game is rated mature and contains content not suitable for younger viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everyone and welcome back to Skyrim. On the last episode, we uh, continued on with exploring places on the island of Solstheim. We headed over to Falbahars, uh, another dwarven uh, ruin that was located on the island because we were trying to look for some of these Kagrimes resonance gems and there was supposedly going to be one there if we found one at the other dwarven ruin. Uh, we found out that there was some um, treasure hunters here that were trying to find something at the end called the Visage of Mazund. Uh, which, now that I'm thinking about it, I don't think I actually picked it up. So, oops. <laughs> I don't think I have it because I didn't see it in my inventory. Anyway, I mean, we went through the entire dungeon, jumped over a bunch of gears, dropped over, uh, rotated some paths across, played a little puzzle with a boiler to get it to, like, the accurate number. Uh... Yeah, we got to the end, and then I guess we just ignored the we ignored the re the reward. <laughs> so, oops, we did have to go back to Falbahars because there was that goes to the tribunal quest, a creation club uh, quest line that we accidentally stumbled upon in there. So we just decided to start it, uh, and finding out about this mysterious other forge that's located in Falbahars that requires its own gems. So this episode. We're, we're gonna head to Kagrimez, but I'm actually, I actually wanna go get that hat now, <laughs> because I forgot it. I feel like a dum-dum. Ah, crap, I could've went to the, uh, I could've went to the elevator. The elevator's next to the abandoned lodge. Lovely. I love what it says in the bottom right corner. Yeah, this place is 100% abandoned now, now that there's no more uh, Thalmor here. Surprised that the Thalmor made their way all the way up, up here. I mean, to be fair, we do know about them because of the north side landing. I love how we went through this entire dungeon, and then we just completely ignored the reward at the end. I didn't pick it up, right? The Visions of a Sun. Mmm. I thought it was just a normal dwarven hat. Well, it's mine now. <laughs> Oops. Alright, now we're off to our destination. Kagrimez. We did see this briefly, and it looks like there's some excavation here. A lot more professional than the one we were just at at Kilburn Barrow. I say professional, yet there's already some blood here. Hmm. And also that barrel's going through the wall. Is there anyone alive? There's a bunch of fire over here. What the heck is this? Oh, th that's some spiders. Let's not worry about the spiders then. Hello? Is this an excavation? It might be. I mean, this all seems like it's was here, so maybe they were just like... They probably found it and then started digging inwards. Some ash is starting to seep through, though. Mm. Alright, there's no sign of people. That might not always be a bad sign. Okay, there's already dead things here, so... Any goodies? Lots of things to make arrows out of if I really wanted to. Or bolts. We're kind of at that point now where bolts are probably better. Eh. Zephyr shoots a lot faster. Got some deceased spiders. And we did see blood, so we know there's at least someone that's living here. <laughs> Living in quotes.
on. All right, it looks like the ooh, they're next to one of those, another one of those like little pillar things that require gems. That was not the guy I was aimed at. All right, what do you have on you? You were trying to solve things. Oh, you had the other two Kagrimes residence gems. All right, we'll take those. Let's see, I am closer to solving the mystery of these ruins. I found references in ancient Dwemer texts that, ca that call Kagrimes the site of a set of trials, a training ground of sorts. This is thus far unprecedented in my research. This could explain why that gate is so unmovable. The proper trial has not been completed. It is possible nobody has opened this gate since the days of the Dwemer. What treasures of the ancient world lie in wait behind these doors? The pattern on the gate seems to hold the solution to unlocking it. It bears resemblance to the console in the center of the chamber. But what does that mean? There are nine holes that I assume are to be filled, but with what? If only I had the means to fund more expeditions to the other Dwemer ruins of Solstheim. They surely hold the keys to opening the locked gate. Even if I had the means to start the trials, I surely have not the means to complete them. Can't wait for more funding. I'm going to have to recruit those who will act on the promise of treasure alone. Surely there are those as excited about this fine as I am. Rail of the Dairy. Eldry. Well, I mean, I guess I'm a, I'm, I'm a professional treasure hunter, so I guess it'll work. Although it looks like there are some possible traps here. Resonance jam. All right, so what was the clue? I saw one thing that I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna start speculating on, but I mean, there's this thing over here on the wall right here. Left, middle, and bottom right. Okay, I think I did it wrong. Or maybe this is the trial. Okay, hold on. I can't shoot if I my I can't shoot if I'm not looking at them. I missed. That was not the final one. That did open up the path. I mean, there's no, we can't see anything up there. And there does look see, there does look to be a path that way, but there's no way we could reach it. And this is the one that had the door. All right, well. So you needed two to get through that door, which is probably why the guy had two on it. Holy crap. Took a, I took a, I took a, I took a thing. We'll take the inexpensive things. Bent, Dwemer, scrap metal. All right, so we got the top and bottom middle and the bottom right. There's also this. Oh, hi there, Steadfast Orbit Spider. You seem friendly. You should follow me. I got a follower. This guy's gonna help. All right. So we got top, bottom, bottom right. All right. Let's go back to the thing and activate it. So this is where we would have needed the extra three. The one from Nichardak, the one from Falbahars, and the one from the guy that was selling it. Go there. All right. You there?
Okay, we got another battle of some sort. Who are we fighting? Where are we fighting? Holy crap, that's a lot of them. I'm worried about my friend. Ow, fire. Did I... Did I anger my friend? Hey, hey, buddy. Hey, hey, can you calm your... Calm, calm it for a bit? Oh, there you are. Calm doesn't work on... Wait, no, no, no. Calm works on things now that I have that thing. Hold on. Uh, alteration. That's not it. Illusion. Calm. Pacify. Doors open. Doors open, yet this is not. Did I go the wrong way? Are you even my buddy? Dwarven spider worker. Oh. Steadfast Dwarven spider. No, that's my friend. You're not my friend. That's why I didn't solve. Oh, my friend died. All right, now the door's open. Okay. Well, that should get us through. Hopefully there's no more door puzzles because I don't have any more gems to deal with. Oh, I'm a liar. What the heck? Oh, wait, wait. Actually, I might... It didn't take them, did it? Yeah, I just have five. Okay. <laughs> I just needed four to do that next step. Hey, buddy. Aw. You seem friendly. Wanna be my friend? I got a pal now. All right. So diagonal T looking up to the right. Don't you love that description? <laughs> Does it make so much sense? <laughs> I hope my new ball friend's following me. I can't wait for him to die and me accidentally think there's someone else that's not him. All right, you, 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 and you. I think I'd start throwing out some of these. Is it just filled with water? Ball friend? Are you my ball friend? You're not my ball friend. You are my ball friend. You survived. Happy days. Although to be fair, I think my I think my spider friend kind of died due to friendly fire. I mean, I didn't kill him, but it was probably like all the electric shocks from killing the other dwarven spiders around him that really didn't help. All right, well, we progress forward. The door is open. That seems to be enough. Ooh. Dwemer arrow diagram. Okay. Oh, the Dwarven Black Bow of Fate. Cool. That's a unique weapon. Also, I think we just learned how to make Soul Stealer arrows. Oh, hello there. 
I think that's what that note was for. Alright, well, let's just continue going forward then. I say forward. Doesn't seem to be much here. Apparently there's also not much over there either. That's just like a place where enemies drop down from. It's an enemy spawning room. Wow, okay. I thought this dungeon was going to be a lot longer than it was. But that seems to be it. Have I not gotten the letter? I guess I haven't gotten the letter from Calselmo. Oh, I'm gonna have to come back here. <laughs> I'm good. To go. All right, you know what? Let's go. Let's go talk with our friend Calselmo. See what the heck he's talking about. Because technically we're done here. This guy. So we didn't even need to find all five. We only needed to find four. I didn't know that. We went to Dun Valbahar's last episode. <laughs> Is Drummer Friend gonna follow me outside? Sure sounds like it. Hey! It's time for us to part ways. He'll stay here. My pet heads back home. Oh, listen to me. You just went back inside. Alright, Kelselmo. I need to learn something from you. What kind of weapon is this? The Northern Maiden is ship shape and ready to go. Yeah, because it says right here you can find several Soul Stealer arrows, but we didn't. I should go to a forge and take a look. Because it says I should be able to just start crafting them. I think I've had Soul Sealer arrows. I know I've found several random ones. It's probably going to be in miscellaneous. Soul Gem Arrowhead, Soul Sealer arrows. All right, so I already know how to make them. That probably was the letter that we found, or like the instruction note that we found there. This thing. Yeah, that shows a soul gem. I was paying more attention to the arrow. Well then. That was simple. <laughs> Back to soul time we go. Well, with that done, what does that leave us with? That was like the last major quest that we could do. Captain Gyalin does the business around here. I'm just a ship's mate. If you're looking for passage, talk to Captain Gyalin. I mean, there's the dungeons that we still have to do. Especially the very long ones that we have left to do. What about quests? What other quests do we have here? We gotta do the we gotta do the put a fork in it quest. For uh Chiogorath with the fork that we have in our inventory. <laughs> There's also the other Solstheim quest that isn't actually on Solstheim, but like I said, I think we're saving that for like the final episode as the last thing to do. There's this dungeon. Cold Cinder Cave. Like I said, I think if, I think when you try and escape from prison, you go through this cave. Yeah, 
You silly Billy. Holy... Oh, God! Okay, so there might be some traps here. The Bulwark Jail. Well, I don't want to break into jail. It's kind of, it's kind of backwards. So I think just exploring this cave was good enough, I guess. I mean, I guess if I need to clear it, I need to kill these netches here. I'm sorry. Hmm. It doesn't say clear. How the heck do I clear Cold Cinder Cave? Says clearable, yes. Two entrances, one via Great and Bulwark Jail, near the top of the Bulwark. Apparently there's like another section of the cave? Ah. Oh yeah, this looks more like the dungeon I was expecting. There's a chest is waiting over there too. I like all these weird ruins here too. It's kind of creepy. with the ash spawn popping in who knows where random apothecary satchel Now it's cleared. Sweet! So I guess this is... Yeah, so everything that we just did to before entering this section was like the jail escape section. This part was just like... Oh, well, there's an extra part. Cool. Now we have the other dungeons. All right, Frostle seemed like it was the shortest out of the... Uh, how many places do we have left? Bristleback, Damp Hall, Brossel. That's it. Just those three. All right. Oh, there's only three places left? I mean, one of them that we're not counting right now is uh, Last Vigil, which isn't actually on the island. This just says there's a lot of traps. Nothing nothing unique here. Also just a bunch of reeklings. Hi. <laughs>
One second, I'm gonna get to look at like their weird random way of sorting stuff. It's kind of fun. They do a good job of like putting similar things next to similar things. Anything that's like expensive. Ingots are not really that expensive anymore, but sure, why not? I'm expecting more to pop out of barrels. They're getting all these strong boxes, but none of them have any, uh. There's a trap right there. None of them have any. East Empire pendants in them. Not like I'm really selling them anymore. Oh, there's a dead rabbit. <laughs> Made me jump. Ugh, wasn't prepared for that guy to be in there. Hunter Storm Atronach, cool. There's an East Empire Company book. I don't trust the books anymore, or the barrels anymore. I mean, this barrel definitely has one. I mean, what am I, what am I doing? The barrels look like this now. Not like this. They're supposed to look like that, but we patched the game. So, yeah, any weird barrel, I should immediately know. Although that first one, the one that scared me... Just jumped out of the ground. Like that one. Not just barrels, I think, that they can jump out of, though. I mean, we saw them jump out of the ground. What the heck are they worshipping? I feel like being a jerk. I feel like being a jerk. That centers on the caster. Uh... I think that ended before it reached any of them. Alright, maybe now it's time for like some super duper destructive stuff. That was an expert level. Give me a master. Okay, you're very rude. Okay, the master one requires time to charge. So we'll just go with uh, fire storm. Oh, you're still alive. Barely. I think that blasted enough. What the heck is this? They found like a weird horse and froze it? Oh, it's not even a real horse. Still, very creepy. Very creepy. Ah, here's what we want, though. Ooh, I'm with the Vela statue here as well. For some reason, I'm collecting these now.
boy, it sure is nice when they, well, they, it was even, they even had fine clothes and they didn't rip them up. Lovely. Very lovely. What's up here? Eh, not much. There's a gourd. That looks like it's it. Okay, where is this taking us? I think it's just taking us out of Frostle. Or it's taking us to a shortcut that takes us back to the beginning. Where it certainly did. Am I going the right way? I am not. This is the way out. Alright, that wasn't so bad. We have two other dungeons, though. How quick can we get those done? Once we get those done, what the heck are we doing next episode? <laughs> Frost is cleared. Uh, okay, so we have Bristleback Cave and the Damp Hall Mine. Yeah, it does, it does say that this is very long. It could just be, ex like, I mean, I guess because it's a Reekling camp. It's just explaining, like, everything that they have gathered. Oh, hello there. Oh, hello there. Hi. Didn't think that the, uh, thing having the bone mold armor, the bone mold armor would be a re reaver. Okay, what's back here first? Probably the exit. There's there's probably a way to finagle my way up there. I wouldn't make any promises though. Yeah, let's just let's just do it the normal way. That's the way out though. Taking a look through everything that they own. Was there a potion in there? There was. Did I need the potion? No. <laughs> Better not see you praying to anything else. I mean, you can pray to whatever you want. It was just creepy last time I saw it. But then again, I'm not a Reekling, so what would I know? Take back what I said. You can pray to whatever you want. Took a bowl. Another Debella statue. They have a lot of shovels. I'm not sure if they're actually using them or not. Shoals are kind of their size. Oh, hi there. Is that meat? That's boar meat. Get out of there. This section of the map's clear. Time to take a look-see. Okay, I just sent one of the drinks flying, and I don't know where it went. Oh, a master level chest. Probably not going to be worth it to open, but now I must know. Yeah, certainly was. I think I just took a cup. 
Ooh, fire doesn't hurt. Yay, I'm fire immune. Look at this. They got like a horker head here. Maybe this is just a case of that. There's so much stuff. That's why the... Oops. That's why the page is so long. That's just empty wine bottles. You guys all suck. Uh, but they're saving all their super duper riches for the end of the cave. That's what it is. Another East Empire Company strong box. Ooh, look at these ones. Some haunting brew mead. That's not a bad selection. Roasting some horker meat. Lovely, delicious. But we just keep on going further down and down. Holy crap, look at all the soul gem frags in here. Why am I taking them? Ooh, they even had skooma. I forgot they got a lot of skooma here. I think one of them was empty. So there's just a very high reekling around here somewhere. Chasing me. Long stick. Oh, they have an ore here. This seems like it might be the final room. It's sadly not even fair anymore. <laughs> Just kind of storming through this place. It's not like I have a... Ooh. It's not like I have a vendetta against them. It's just that they're all annoying. I guess that's my vendetta. I'm scared of going down into the... Into the uh, I mean, it looks like there's something down there, but I don't know how to get back out. But I might have to find out. Aha, you just gave me soul gems. I'm thankful that there have not been any crashes today like there was last time. Okay, so it looks like if I fall, there is a cave going that way, but I don't know where it comes out at. Oh, and you're still alive. <laughs> okay, it looked like it was completely upside down at one point. This is not where they keep their best things. It's another master chest. They probably just threw it down here because they couldn't. They didn't know how to open it. Maybe they're. Maybe Reeklings are like super duper good at picking locks. Want to join the thieves guild? You can have like all the weird little trinkets that you can ever think of. Or chalcoming it. I almost took the empty wine bottle. All right. There was an entrance back there. I didn't see it. I haven't found the... I haven't found the boss chest yet. So maybe this isn't the end. 
Then again, there probably doesn't have to be a boss chest. Usually nice if there is, though. I also haven't reached the end, so... Ah! There it is! On cue. That didn't take it that long either. No, like, super duper rich spot that had, like, a bunch of treasures. At least, not that I could, not that I saw. Alright, that leaves. That leaves one damp hall mine as the final location. I'll find you. What I do? Oh, uh, you guys suck. <laughs> I'll find you. And didn't do a thing. Okay, the problem with this one is that this one sounds like it's more, uh, it's not Reeklings. This one's Reavers. Oh, there's another spot! How did I, how did I keep on forgetting about that spot? How many is that? I saw the Fadrick brothers bobbing around in there this morning, so that makes three. And now we're stuck out here listening to it all day and night. I'd rather be stuck out here than floating in there. iron ore sounds like they uh, captured some guys the Fallen brothers ooh who's this guy holy that goes deep that goes real deep Raise zombie. I already know it. I'll take it anyway. So I guess there's a lot of people died when this bridge collapsed. Do they not know how to swim? Either of you named characters. Outlaw, outlaw. All right, well. What was that? I hit the wall. There we go. <laughs> Look at this thing right here. Big cheese. I don't know. I'm not taking all the cheese I see. Did that just say meat pie? Oh, that's a meat pie. That is a meat pile. I was about to ask, what's a meat pile? I took the bowl and not the food. I took the fork and not the food. Clam meat. Oh, we got a fishing spot here. All right, what about underneath? Anything around here? Some barnacles. Some clams. There's a fish right here. I could just grab them like this. Ooh, dire fish. <laughs> Let's not let them know that I'm here. It's more insulting that way.
guy just like, okay, I'm on fire now. There's another Dibella statue. Oh, hi there. Anybody there? No? Take my bolt back. Ooh. Well hidden chest. The bread doesn't look that interesting. It seemed like it was almost like half moldy. Oh well. You guys have a nice base. It's a shame I'm ruining it all. A little place here where they got flowers growing? Without even really any sunlight? That's kind of nice. Oh, hi there, friend. Ooh. Uh, nothing? I'll take my bolt back. I want to be over 600. I like the mining stop. No, look at that blood spurt. Okay, you had all the you had all the drinks and stuff in here. I took the shovel. Oh, the storm shield. Even though it's so pointless. It looks so nice. And this one's just beds. Gimme. All that for 36 gold. Wow, this one person has their own tent? Living large there. So here's some footsteps. I don't know if that's a bad thing. Oh. What are you wearing? I thought you were wearing like a weird... Okay. It looked like you were wearing a toupee. I was like, what kind of hair do you have? this way keep on going up probably a good sign hidden wall right here do you have three steel maces oh you had two you had two fishing rods that's weirder There's the boss just behind that guy. Ooh, he dodged at the right point. Stay there. And a trap door in a certain doom. Reaver Lord, oh, I'll take the treasure room key. Yes, please. Fur armor, fur boots. Okay, I'll take those too. Steel shield of waning fire. Ooh. I'm glad I couldn't take the bowl. Iron great sword of embers. I'll take that just because it sounds unique. doesn't go up anywhere this goes also nowhere what's the exit then where do you go from I guess you just drop well, 
That should be fun. Oh! <laughs> That's the drop! Huh, okay. What, did they not think that they could survive the drop in the water? You don't, you don't get hurt if you fall in water. That's a classic video game thing. Water cancels out all drop, all fall damage. You know, like in real life. <laughs> okay, we got one more place to look. I completely forgot. Yes, it's the altar, 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 altar. Altar Thrond. So you found the body here, the sacrifice. It's a lot of blood. Did they sacrifice, did they kill him inside? Or did they kill him outside? Okay, there's another sacrifice, there's you. Ooh, someone heard me. Alchemist. Filets. You had a name. Had a name. Etienne. I wonder what the name of the third one was. Crafting feathers. That's different. Oh, what was your name? Isabel. Okay, what are the crafting feathers for? I'm so confused. Maybe there's something in the back of the cave? Just the boss chest. Mmm, human flesh in a cooking pot. Oh, and more human flesh. I tried to mantle that. I don't know why I thought I could. I think that's it in here. So this is the altar? Well, that was simple. What are the what are the crafting feathers for? Altar of Throned. Da, 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 da. Doesn't say anything about crafting feathers, which is, uh... Surprising. Maybe it's for, like, things in Heartfire. Oh well. And with that, that should be every location on Soul Slime cleared. Well, not including Asphalt's hair, which we have to go through for uh, for a later thing. And every place that can be cleared is cleared. That's good. Just means that we're ever so close of finally finishing this game. Uh, 
so with that, I mean, we also have all of the quests done. Well, almost all the quests done. We probably could swing over to start working on the Creation Club quest. Because I think technically everything vanilla is done, except for one thing. But yeah, everything vanilla is now complete. <laughs> Which is saying... And saying that that's a... I mean, that's a lot of stuff done. But now we have, like, all the Creation Club stuff to deal with. So... Since we already have a start onto it, we might start... You might continue on with the Saints and Seducers things, because there's a lot of, like, items that we get for that quest line that I really need to get, just so that we know that we're going to get them. Like, books and spells and stuff. So if you get those done, then I don't have to worry about them anymore. Then we'll probably work on Ghost of the Tribunal. Any other, like, side Creation Club quest lines that we haven't completed? Like, we have to go get, like, all the different horses... Like, way down here. I gotta go tame all these horses. We gotta get... Do We gotta use the thing with the fork here. So we'll probably do that after we do the Ghost of the Tribunal, because that also brings us back over to Soul's Time. And then we can finally do fishing, which I've been looking forward to all this time. And it will no way, in any way whatsoever, be disappointing or, like, uh, not worth it. <laughs> and then I think we'll be pretty much wrapped up with everything at that point. Oh, God, we might be done, like, soon, soon. Sooner than I thought. I don't think we're going to... There's no way we're finishing in next episode. So it's not 2.10. 2.20 might be a possibility, though. We'll see. 2.20 might be the goal. Or 2.15... Eh, 2.15 doesn't seem like a right goal either. 2.20, I think, is probably a goal that we should aim for at this point. 10 episodes? <laughs> we'll see. So... On the, yeah, on the next episode of Skyrim, we head back over to the mainland and start working on some of these Creation Club quest lines, uh, starting with Saints and Seducers. So, until next time, hopefully you enjoy. Mm -hmm.